1995, Chief Olusegu Obasanjo was arrested, convicted and sentenced to 30 years imprisonment for being part of a planned military coup against the most brutal and ruthless military regime in the history of Nigeria. Chief Olusegun Obasanjo is a Nigerian retired military officer and statesman who served as Nigeria's head of state from 1976 to 1979 and later as its president from 1999 to 2007. Ideologically a Nigerian nationalist, Obasanjo was educated largely in Abiokuta, Ogun State. Joining the Nigerian army, where he specialized in engineering, he spent time assigned in the Congo. Britain and India, rising to the rank of a major. In 1975, a military coup led by Shehu Musaya Radua and Joseph Gaba ousted Gowon, who was the then military head of state. The coup plotters wanted to replace Gowon's autocratic rule with a group of three brigaders whose decisions could be vetoed by a supreme military council. For this, they convinced Mutala Mohammed to become head of state with Obasanjo as his second in command and Dan Juma as the third in charge. In February 1976, Colonel Sukadimka launched a coup against Mutala Mohammed's government during which General Mutala Mohammed was assassinated. An attempt was also made on Obasanjo's life, but the wrong individual was killed. After Mutala Mohammed's assassination, the Supreme Military Council persuaded Obasanjo to take over the government as head of state. Aware of the danger of isolating northern Nigerians, Obasanjo brought in General Shehu Yaradua as his replacement and second in command, and Theophilus Danjuma as chief of staff, completing the group. Committed to restoring democracy, Obasanjo oversaw the 1979 election, after which he handed over control of Nigeria to the newly elected civilian president of Shegu Shagari. In 1993, during the crisis of the Second Republic, General Sani Abacha, on November 1993, overthrew the short-lived transitional government of NS Shonenka. Abacha was known as a man of few words and deadly actions. He demonstrated this as head of state with one of the most brutal regime Nigeria has ever had. He issued a decree that placed his government above the legal decisions of the court, effectively giving him the absolute power and also giving him the right to detain anyone for up to three months without trial. Openly critical of Abacha's administration, in 1995, Obasanjo was arrested and convicted of being part of a planned military coup. Despite protesting his innocency, he was sentenced to 30 years imprisonment, which Abacha later reduced to 15 years. He was released in 1995 by General Abdusalami Abubakar, exactly one week after Abacha passed away. Obasanjo became PDP candidate for the 1999 presidential election, which he won comfortably. As president, he depoliticized the military and both expanded the police and mobilized the army. He gained international respect through his efforts to end white minority in South Africa and Zimbabwe. He was re-elected in the 2003 election, influenced by pan-African ideas. <laughs> 